హలో ఫ్రెండ్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు మై ఛానల్ డెవాప్స్ విజయ్ టుడే వీ విల్ బి లర్నింగ్ అబౌట్ హౌ టు ఫైండ్ ద ఎన్వైర్మెంట్ వేరియబుల్స్ విచ్ ఈస్ ప్రెజెంటెడ్ బై జెన్కిన్స్ బై డిఫాల్ట్ అండ్ వేర్ టు ఫైండ్ ద లిస్ట్ ఆఫ్ దోస్ ఎన్వైర్మెంట్ వేరియబుల్స్ అండ్ హౌ టు యూస్ ఇన్ యువర్ శాంపల్ జాబ్ ఆర్ ఇన్ యువర్ జాబ్ ఓకే ఫస్ట్ బ్రౌజ్ ద జెన్కిన్స్ యూఆర్ఎల్ ఓకే దెన్ గో టు ద మేనేజ్ జెన్కిన్స్ scroll down you will see system informations this will display various environment information to assist troubleshooting okay this will show you system properties if you scroll down you will see environment variables okay if you see these are the environment variables which is set on the os where operating system where the jenkins is running and which is helping the jenkins to run jenkins controller okay so these are the environment variable which you can use but these are not very useful in your jobs okay so now how to get the default or the most used environment variable present inside jenkins like build number branch name commit id for that paste the url localhost 8080 env wars dot html as soon as you click enter you will get one page i'll give this link into the description also so following variables are available to shell and batch build steps you can see branch name branch summary change id change target tag name tag date so these are the useful build id build number these are the useful environment variable which gets generated during the build run and it is very useful to implement in automation so let's try to use uh, one of the uh, i'll use the build number okay in one of the jobs simple jobs let's go back to the jenkins ui open any job okay configure i have connected this job to windows slave machine so i will go to the build step execute windows batch command and then i will say echo echo percentage percentage and build number copy this paste it here okay so apply save it okay so now build number environment variable is available what what is the value of this that will get generated dynamically build number means right now current build number is 24 you can see running number is there so when you print this it should print 25 okay let's go ahead and trigger this job click on build let's go to the console output okay so whatever the previous setup was already there it was running those and finally then echo 25 you can see it has printed 25 so this way if you use these environment variables in jenkins you will find you will be able to create a lot of automation with ease like you have multiple components you want to push the artifact with a build number so you can the use this environment variable okay so these are very useful in in achieving the automation for multiple projects and to segregate one artifact to another artifacts i hope you like this video thank you for watching